Right. Um, yeah. And other things that I normally, uh, yeah, sort of like, you know, yeah, say. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I was just playing, uh, I, was, I was playing a bit more of the game, as you can see, uh, which I d usually do in between uh, like recordings. Um, what is this? Um, now remember when I said I was abducted by aliens? I think they may have inserted something in me other than the, uh, the probe, if you know what I mean. <laughs> um, I think something may have, uh, also been, uh, inserted. Because I was just standing there. Like, well, I was standing there. But, uh, the scene was standing there. All of a sudden, as like an event usually does, it kind of went to him and sort of, he sort of, I don't know, jumped somehow. And not, 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 not jumped as in like jumped up in the air, just kind of the shocked jump. And all of a sudden, his stomach went, like, like sort of popped out. Uh, slightly there. Um, then a message came up. My sim is uh, basically pregnant. Um, as you may have seen in that previous video uh, towards the end, um, he got up to a bit of woohoo. Um, I am not sure how that will affect anybody else um but my sim is pregnant um i'm <laughs> i'm guessing this uh, i mean you've got these like smarty face boxer shorts this vest i'm thinking this is his version of maternity wear <laughs> um Right, so this is going to be quite interesting. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how this is going to... Uh, to go. Um, what I have suddenly noticed, I'm using uh, a different program to record now, the DX Story. And, well, things seem to be running a bit better. Uh, before I was using Bandicam. Um, as you can see, this seems to be running a bit better. But the thing you've got to remember with DX Story is if you use the DX Story codec, uh, it does take something like a gigabyte of space every five minutes or something like that so <laughs> well, I'm expecting this uh, to be quite big right um, I wasn't I, I, I've got to say I wasn't really going to record um, uh, sort of any more just yet I mean this like alien pregnancy thing has happened literally only like five minutes after I stopped recording the previous uh, video um, so yeah this is gonna be very interesting indeed uh, not exactly sure because that was the thing funnily enough when he went to the, the uh, he went to the fridge. Uh, I'm guessing took something out to eat. And next thing I know, well, I, I don't know why he ran upstairs when there's a toilet downstairs, but he ran upstairs and was sick in the toilet. That was what gave me the first indication that he may be pregnant. And I'm thinking, right, how does he get pregnant? 
<laughs> because as you can see at the bottom in the fears there one is throw up as in morning sickness oh come on just just do something to eat I don't know well grilled cheese sandwich that's the that seems to be the Sims staple diet uh, so yeah he come to the fridge well come came to the fridge did he just spend a thousand sim simoleons or something then anyway uh, like I say he ran upstairs was sick and I'm thinking right this seems like morning sickness because there would be no other reason for him to be sick there's no bad food in the fridge um, and this is what kind of got me a little confused so as it says at the bottom here yeah, throw up obviously he has a fear of throwing up because <laughs> of this uh, alien pregnancy have an accident, I'm not exactly sure what that means. I think he's a, he will be frightened when his waters break, <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, and he, he, he doesn't want to pass out. The thing that uh, has got me intrigued, because I've never seen it before, and I don't think I've ever seen any videos of it on YouTube, um, what will this baby look like? Uh, will it be a human baby? Um, will it turn out to be... I don't know. Oh, yeah, I don't know who you are, people. Go away. Um, so, this... This has suddenly got interesting. Uh, yeah, I seem to be able to serve chips and dip platters every time I cook something. So, who's calling now? Oh, it's that one. That was a good thing with... That oh, doesn't say a name. What was her name? El... El Gisdor or something. She usually just likes to talk. Unlike Sonny, who likes to invite me out on dates at every inappropriate moment. Right, so... Let's let him talk for a little while. Basically just to get his uh, social skill up and obviously improve his relationship status and it just went off. So, yeah, there's a toilet he could have easily used instead of running upstairs uh, to be sick. <laughs> And then after that, you want to take a shower because you're starting to smell a bit. So, right, uh, what I will do, I'm not going to like just continually record this like, until something happens. When stuff starts happening, then I will uh, carry on with the recording, obviously. So, let me just pause it there and I will be back when something happens. Um, right. Update. Bump has just gotten bigger. And my sim appears to be wearing what I'm guessing are his maternity clothes. Um, <laughs> which is kind of like this flowery t-shirt, uh, jogging bottoms and sneakers, trainers, whatever you want to call them. Um, seems happy about it, by the way. I mean, I'm not really sure what to think of it. Um, my sim appears to be quite happy about being pregnant and have been impregnated by aliens it's not exactly the thing that you would like brag about to everyone but there, <laughs> there you go uh, yeah so let's uh, let's just carry on a little bit so 
like I said before, I'm not sure. Oh, see, so it seems to be loving it. It's like, mm, this is my baby in my belly. <laughs> um, <laughs> and so, uh, hmm, I do seem to want to watch a lot of TV. I'm not sure if that's like because he wants to get in touch with his feminine side. I'm not sure, but uh, this is what I can't understand is uh, how really did he get pregnant? I mean, obviously, it's aliens. <laughs> um, but it's. I really don't know what to think. I really do not know what to think at, at this stage. Um, I mean, I'm, everybody knows the old uh, the old finger uh, You know, aliens. <laughs> you, you see all these stories in what is it, the National Enquirer and stuff like that. Aliens ate my baby and all whatever. You know. Aliens got me pregnant. Immaculate conception and all this, all this jollop. But hmm, I mean, it hasn't really like made any difference to the way I'm. I, you know, I'm sort of still playing the game, doing things. It's kind of scuppered my plans to, like when I was saying about building him up, getting some muscle and going to kick that guy's ass that's uh, that's kind of put that on hold <laughs> right now um, I mean I can't exactly go on a treadmill while pregnant because the, the thing popped up about um, Basically, like, taking things easy and and blah blah blah. Uh, so, hey, what does this guy want? Go away, What's it? Jason Menon. Um, so yeah, that's kind of pushed things back a little bit. Um, I was hoping to uh, to kind of get that done fairly soon. Going to kick butt. So, but as it is for now, um, I mean, I guess I'm just going to have to, well, as it says, take it easy and, uh, yeah. So, anyway. I will leave that bit there. Uh, like I said, I will pause recording for a, a, a little while, and when things start to happen, then I will start recording again. So, be right back. Oh, okay. Here we go. I just happened to have my hand next to the keyboard where I could press the zero button to pause the to pause the game just as the cine well I'll say cinematic the game kind of centered on my scene something is about to happen I think he's already quite big now I'm guessing oh that's uh, Jodie Larson one of the new sims they're one of the existing families that I moved in and basically she was walking past so she visited. Anyway, the excitement is about to happen. I think something's about to happen anyway. Let's find out. Here we go. Oh, oh my belly. Oh, and... Uh, I'm not exactly sure what's going on. Um, oh no. Oh crap. What? There's two new babies in the family. 
Oh, hello. What's going on here then? Oh, uh, obviously. Oh. oh, hang on. Ah! <laughs> it's a baby plum! Whoa! Uh. Uh, it's it's a little green baby. Um. Ah. Uh, da 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 da. Wow. Uh. Right. But that's just one. <laughs> so in typical Sim style, <laughs> it just. Places the baby on the floor. Oh, hello, and here comes the other one. Oh, really? Two. Oh, it, it, it's bad enough. Oh, hello. Ah. Oh. Uh, what's this? MG has been given an additional three days off in order to give the newborn all the attention it deserves and needs. Oh man, it, this is just not happening right now. <laughs> um, uh, two babies. And the, the fact that I am a male seems to defy all logic because once again aliens. So uh, right. <laughs> uh, what we can name uh, Name the kids. Uh, this isn't exactly something I can just pass out to the public there. Say, name my children, because I'm kind of recording this. If it was live, then yeah. Um, <laughs> um, I really have no idea. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, a, a, a baby alien girl. What would you call her? Um, <laughs> Susie Tron? <laughs> no. Oh my god. This I was not expecting. Oh, oh, actually, I was expecting. No. Uh, right, think of a name. Think of a name, think of a name, think of a name, think of a name. I can't think of any bloody names. I can't even think of a boy's name to name the boy. And the worst part about this is... I turned ageing off. So the fact that these will stay babies, like, forever is... Uh, something... I didn't really want to deal with that. <laughs> I was going to say something I've got to deal with it now. I don't really want to deal with alien babies forever. Um, so what can I call the girl? Um, 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 baby girl. <laughs> Baby girl Iceman. Mm. Because obviously the last name will be Iceman because we're the Iceman family because I kind of did the wrong thing and instead of putting my name as uh, like Iceman MG so we so that we would be the MG family I called myself MG Iceman. No, actually I did that, didn't I? Uh, no. No, that's right, I did put Iceman MG. Instead of MG Iceman. Oh, whatever. Anyway, with the Iceman family. So, this is the thing. Uh, oh, good grief. <laughs> I have absolutely no idea what to call children. I mean, I, it, it took a while to name my own kids. I was in my real life kids. So. Uh, let me think for just a brief moment. Okay, 
I've got it. Seems they're aliens, and the only thing I can think of is Xanadu. <laughs> we shall call the girl Xanadu. Xanadu! And because I can't think of a boy's name except Xander Witch, it's actually a name in the game, I think. I'm not sure if it's spelt with an X, but there we go. They can be named that. Right. Xanadu and Xander. Except. Yes. <laughs> um. Right. So he wants to kiss. He wants to be struck by lightning. <laughs> yes, after giving birth to two alien babies, babies. The one thing you really want is to be struck by lightning, isn't it? Uh, well, basically, is, is he dead? I mean, that one's moving, but... He's just, like, lying there. <laughs> um, right, so there you go. You have witnessed the birth of my babies. You will know the pro... Uh, all the parents of my babies. <laughs> Please come and take them. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, obviously. Uh, right, so this has made the game way more interesting. Um, I will figure out what to do. Uh, as he puts the other one on the floor. And <laughs> See, that one's moving. Look, it, Oh, I don't, I don't know. I don't, uh, what is going to put? Oh, I thought he was going to put the baby in the fridge. Then, oh, oh look, yeah, yeah, he's got thought. He's like, oh, don't leave me. Why are you leaving me? What did I ever do to you? <gasps> right. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, I have a bit of a mental breakdown here. If you've been silly enough to watch all this nonsense. I thank you very much indeed. Uh, if you would like to see more of this nonsense, please like and subscribe and uh, all other nonsense. And I shall see you next time. Bye.